ever set up an ice house. Um, I have to figure all it out, like figure out how to use my auger that I just bought. Um, all of it is brand, brand new to me, but I think I can figure it out. And uh, I got some friends coming out there to fish with me on and off. So some of it I'll be by myself, some of it I'll have people around, but either way, it'll be fun. It's really nice out and just hoping to catch some sturgeon. Okay, so I just got to the road that goes out to the river to access. It's really bumpy and it's really muddy, but I'm almost there. I'm just heading in right now to the landing. <laughs> oh my gosh. I just got here. I'm actually kind of nervous to set up my tent for the first time just because there's a lot of people around here and I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna try to figure this out. We'll see how it works. house for the first time. I think it'll get better next time. Hopefully. So I bought a mat. I have a couple other like interlocking mats. So I don't really know what to do with my floor. I honestly didn't know like I'd be able to figure this out and it's not even that hard. I think the hardest part was actually fitting everything in my car. I'm so excited right now. I'm like shaking. I'm so excited right now. So I have a friend coming out to join me and I'm gonna drill some more holes. I just got this ice scoop. I just got it from this place because I got my auger with them. Crazy awesome deal. I just discovered them and they, they are awesome. So I had to mention them in there. They actually threw this ice scoop in with my auger. Pretty sweet. So I'm still setting up and I have a friend that just showed up, Lewis. We're actually gonna be setting our lines. I just drilled a couple like single holes just until we get the fish house set up, so. I have. Them ones are a little bigger. Should I use this? Yeah, I just have that one for this. Do you use a weight on there? There shouldn't be any current here. Do you have a bigger treble? Yep, in here, this is all my stuff. Oh, ouch. What are you doing? Oh, okay. oh. Oh, you I'm sorry, just pointing at a cow yet. Lewis! Oh, this is so tight, I can't even move it down. Well, what do you got going on? That's not your line. Oh, it didn't before I handed it to you. Oh, don't get out of here. Ouch. Look, I like, literally broke my nail. Which way are we going to be? Holes over there? Yep. Yep, I'm gonna have them in the corners and then here. Probably do. There 
there, 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 and like Peter right here. Yeah. Oh. Hole. <gasps> I, tripped. I have no idea how to do these and I only have two. So let's, how do I do the steaks? Where do I put them? On this? I have to say, I am pretty proud of my setup. It took me a long time to get it set up. Here's the inside. Look at that. My first setup, that's pretty dang good. Oh, you got one? Oh, you got it. Woo. Reel up, reel up. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow, it's there already. Oh, no. Oh, no, to get up. Look at that. It's bobbing. Little. Is it? Mm-hmm. Slow. Unless I could be imagining it. Probably all the fumes in here. Get me. <laughs> could be. <laughs> but okay. it hasn't pulled it down much. Right. That's what gets me thinking that it's probably a puppy or something. Yeah, it's like nibbling, whatever. I would try it. If that was my bobber, set it good. Ah, oh, that was horrible. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. I tried. I don't know what I did. Oh my god. <laughs> Lewis, it just bobbed. Unless that was me. Maybe that was me. Dang it. <laughs> I think it was me. Check your bait and put that stubby on there. Oh. I got. Mud, oh, puppy. mud puppy! First catch. That's a big one. You grab them things? What are you supposed to do? I don't know. I never touch them. Look at this. Totally wrapped around. Oh. Oh. <laughs> right in the subway. There he goes. Don't let him bite you. <laughs> I told you. Just let him swim away. It like bit at me for a second. I told you he'd bite you. It's biting it. What the heck? See this giant mud puppy. It's gonna be a mud puppy, you know it. Oh, oh. fish on. Holy crap! That's a giant mud puppy. Let's get the ruler. That's a big mud puppy. Where's your scooper? I put that behind you, didn't I? It's right here. Here, I got my tape measure right here too. Yeah, but then you gotta touch it. <sighs> I think I can handle it. Meanwhile, the real sturgeon rods. Super secret sturgeon bait. Wax worms. <laughs> One of these just tried to bite me. I wanna get that on film. Look at that! Oh my god. They're not big teeth, they're just like bass teeth <gasps> or something. You got pliers? That is creepy. <laughs> Slimy as a yolk pot. Thirteen and a half. We just measured it, and it's like thirteen and a half inches when it straightens up. But yeah, look how fat he is. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, we'll get him back in the water. Okay. Wow, that one was unexpected. That was on a wax worm, right? Yep. So we are just packing up because we didn't get any actual sturgeon. One sturgeon that we lost right at the hole. One sunny and a bunch of mud puppies. And that was it. But it was fun. So maybe better luck next time. So I didn't have the greatest ending to my video last night. So I thought I would just say um, real quick, so even though we didn't catch any sturgeon last night, I still had a blast on the river. It's like always fun going on the river. But um, just because I set up my first ice shack and drilled my first holes, 
it was kind of a, a really big memory for me, so I thought I'd post it anyway, even though we didn't get any surgeon. I'm really hoping to get into this in the future, so this is the very beginning of it. It was actually surprisingly way easier than I was thinking it was going to be, so if you are somebody like me and you don't really know how to ice fish and you want to get into it, totally figure it out. I got all my stuff out there in my little Toyota and ice fished the river and I didn't know anything about augers or ice shacks or anything like two weeks ago. So you can totally do it. Um, it's so much fun out there. But thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to give it a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.